Ladies and gentlemen, I'm your host, Killer Slacker, and today we are continuing my Elite Force gameplay. We are leaving off where I left off, where I got upset with Tuvok for getting so upset with me, uh, for doing exactly what I should have. Oh, man, this sucks. This wasn't supposed to happen. How'd the board get here? Rick, relax. Relax? Uh. Relax, those Borg killed Ken. I'm gonna go over there and personally break every one of their grimy necks with my own bare hands. Hey, Monroe, we're going over there, right? We gotta teach them not to mess with Starfleet for Ken. Rick, look, we can't just go over to a Borg ship for revenge. Y yeah, well, what about Foster, huh? He might still be alive. We gotta save him. They probably assimilated them already. Don't say that, man! We can get him. We're a professionally trained hazard team. We'll get him back and give him some for Ken. I have to agree with him, but at the same time I have to disagree. Anyone in here? Nope. But Tuvok was totally just being evil. Monroe, I've been working on Seven Zyma. It's coming along. Should be ready for field. Yeah, so. look at that beast. Granted, it doesn't look at all like what you actually hold in your hand. Really. Part of it seems to be clipped and all that. Holodeck's broken, so no need to go there. Yeah, no, bunny hopping in this case is not something I want to keep doing. I just don't believe there was nothing they could do. Sir, am I interrupting something? Shall I speak freely? Go ahead. Honestly, no. I don't know how I could have gone so poorly. Ken, Foster, Odell, and we lost the Isodesium. What are you trying to say? You try fighting the Borg. I'm saying someone must be to blame. That's all. Yeah, the Borg. Don't you try to take Tuvok's side. The Borg came in, they adapted to our weapons, and we were unable to stop them because we didn't have any melee weapons. Which we really should have for going up against the Borg, by the way. Hey Monroe, I heard Odell's gonna make it. The doc says he got to him just in time. Good thing you found him. Alright, where's the last few team members? There's gotta be a couple more out here. Excuse He's me, can I help you? They aren't talking, they aren't talking. Um, oh. Maybe if I go talk to people individually? Tells you. Alex, look, if you're blaming yourself, don't. None of us saw it coming. We couldn't have done anything. I know. Alright, uh, Chell. Chell? I don't know what we were thinking. We, we weren't ready for this. This is crazy! We're dead in space! We're, we're not gonna make it out of here! Crewman, get a hold of yourself! We'll make it! If you say so, Monroe. The reason why I zoomed in is because he was doing what, uh... Beesman here was doing before, uh, in... I think it was last episode Rick. or maybe the episode before. Don't talk to me, Monroe! I'm wound up! I'm a quantum torpedo ready to blow, man! Uh, Maybe you should go to the holodeck and blow off some steam, Rick. Nah, I'm saving it all up for the Borg. Um, I didn't think quantum torpedoes, quantum torpedoes had been invented yet. Mainly because of the fact that, uh, well, those appear in, a the first time they ever appear is in a movie uh, Star Trek First Contact, which takes Report place to immediately. after uh, Voyager gets back. The tension is real. Deck 8, Astrometrics. Look, Foster's alive. We can still save him. That is a possibility. You may well have the chance to find out. What? Though it goes against my better judgment, you are next in line for command of the hazard team. 
We are going to infiltrate the Borg cube. Yes, I do. Seven and I were going over the Ethereans' data, and we've located a Borg cube here in the dampening field with us. The vessel appears to be heavily damaged. Monroe, you and the Hazard team are going to beam over there and get back the Isodesium. And Foster? Ensign, we're not even sure he's still alive, but if it's possible to rescue him, then yes, by all means. But the Isodesium is of the highest priority. Seven will be joining you on this mission. And Ensign... You are now officially in command of the Hazard Team. Yes, sir. Seven has prepared a plan of action. Since we don't know where the Borg may be storing the Isodesium, I've chosen a beam-in point within reasonable proximity to a primary sub-processing matrix. From there, I should be able to determine the exact location of the Isodesium. Why not beam directly to the matrix? We do not wish to alert the Borg. The beam-in point is in an area of low importance. There is also an assimilation chamber en route. It is possible that Lieutenant Foster is as yet unassimilated and being held there. Hopefully, they'll be too busy repairing their ship to worry about a few trespassers. Sounds good. Get in there. Get the Isodesium. And rescue Foster if you can. Yes, Captain. I will join you and your team in the transporter room. Ms. Monroe, I trust your performance will surpass your previous efforts. Once we have the Isodesium, we beam straight back here. Any questions? Yeah. Why aren't I on this mission? If we're gonna give the Borg some payback, you're gonna need some extra manpower. This isn't a revenge mission, Rick. Our mission is to get the Isodesium back. And rescue Foster. If possible, yes. As for firepower, Seven's Infinity Modulator prototype is ready for field testing. If the Borg turn nasty, we'll be more than ready for it. It is unwise to underestimate the Borg. Yeah, see? You're gonna need me to help eliminate some Borg. Uh, no offense, man. None taken. Beesman, I know you're upset about Ken and Foster, but killing a bunch of Borg isn't going to bring them back. I need cool heads. You're gonna have to learn to control yourself before I can assign you to another mission. Dismissed. Whoa, c come on! I said dismissed. Oh, you're loving this, aren't you? If there are no further delays. Energize. Right, Just keep to yourselves and they should ignore us. This isn't a simulation, so stay sharp. Alright guys, we are once again on a board ship, but we still have the Infinity Modulator. Well, they should consider me a threat. All right, let's keep moving. Wow, this place is huge. Look out! What are you doing? Open fire! Why did somebody fire? What the heck just happened? What were a the errors and b the fact that suddenly they started shooting when typically they don't shoot? At, typically the AI that I work with doesn't try to shoot the Borg at that point. This terminal is malfunctioning. Crewman Chang, 
take out that general. Yeah, that thing there. Yeah, I could do the same thing. I have grenade launcher. Yeah, everyone else run for somewhere where that explosion is so small. It's like why? I don't trust that one. Other than the fact that my team was going to start shooting at it anyway. Quick save here, just in case I fail. Yeah, Foster! Weird... Faced Foster. I found it, Seven. I'll do what I can. Over here. Come on, go down. Almost done. Come on, come on, come on. Heck yeah. I stand corrected, Exo. Good work. You did the right thing. I knew I could do it. Continue with our mission to retrieve the isodiesel. Alright, so I'm not sure. Where does that lead? I'll meet you down there. And I'm also quick saving in case this is a completely stupid idea. Ooh. Ammo I don't need. And now they can attack me. Yay. And then just right up here are them. Oh, these ones are all to just disabled. Don't scare me like that. Don't make me think more boys are beaming in when they're not. And... Okay, I think they're all down. Except that one. And... Beam in. Oh. Yeah, that's scripted. There's pretty much no way to save him. And now beam in. Good! I need ammo. Alright, so until the board get extremely close, uh, I'm going to use the phaser and these uh, weapons that use dilithium over anything that uses my eye mod. Ammo. Because I'm not ammo. Good. Yeah, 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 just, just go. I know. Retreat. That's why I said retreat. Right, they probably have adapted now. Yeah.
Yeah, it doesn't take very long for them to adapt to that one. Just keep him off seven. Hurry up. I am out of ammo. Let's go. Thank you. Took you long enough. Huh. <sighs> Give me full ammo on that. So the only things they haven't adapted to yet are the infinity modulator and the grenade launcher. Which way? Either will suffice. That way has health. I don't have to comply with anything. Energy. You want me to state my intent? I want my ICDCM back. Give me this. Get out of my way. Out of my way. I'm saving our lives. There we go. Saved our lives. And my ammo. Alright. Okay. I need more ammo. Ooh, help. Help! This is fresh health. I don't want to lose it. Alright, so no more ammo, just charge in. Miss a bunch so that ammo goes to waste. Or activate the lift. And quick save, because quick saving is extremely handy. And watch seven get hurt. Alright, charge out, shoot you, shoot you. Continue charging out, shoot you, shoot you, grab some ammo. Anyone else want to show up? Get out of my way. I'm low on ammo again. I don't like being low on them. I mod ammo. Run around here. Dang it. Gotta make every shot count. As long as I can make every shot count, I'm okay. Until I can't. Any information on the Isodesium? 
just a moment. Query. Yes, three levels below. Quaternary Environmental Control Chamber 9 Alpha. There is more, but I cannot access it. Memory is fragmented. That's good enough. Let's get moving. Seven? Seven. I am sorry. I was distracted. Okay, let's move out, people. All right. So Stop shooting, it's me. That did absolutely nothing. Ammo. Grenade launcher. Don't miss. More ammo. Okay. All right. Uh, I don't like you. Go away. No, stop that. Stop that. Stop that. Stop that. All of you, just stop it right where you are. And quit trying to kill me. Ah, this part. I am not a big fan of this area. Come on, I get this up. Come on. Come on. Okay. Drop down here, grab some ammo, run. It's a lot safer. You're welcome for the assistance. How about you come where I can easily shoot you all before I even step out? There you There's another one. No, stop this. Leave me alone. Almost dead, almost dead, almost dead. Ow, even closer to death. Energy, health, life. Don't let anyone near me. Let me flank him. Got him. Okay. I, I didn't hit a button. Oh well. Who cares? Four rounds aren't going to go missing in the long run. No. Where's the... There's an energy. Take it. No help. Okay. Just... Go away. Go away. God. Stop booming in. And then targeting me. Target the AI. Out of my way. Give me health, give me health, give me health, give me health. Or get me onto the area that really... Come on. Dang it. I have to destroy that thing. And I can't shoot it from here. I'm gonna have to shoot it from the. Can I shoot it from here? Can I? I'll be back, guys. I could turn around, or I could come get help. And ammo. 
both of things which are very important. And now that I have health again, I don't feel like I'm going to die. Alright, so we could attack things here, or could just start the cutscene. It is the hub through which all Borg thoughts are processed and organized. It creates order out of chaos. Why am I using a compression rifle? We are at war. She's turned on us. Drop no! The Vinculum must be controlling her. Anson Alexandria Monroe of Starship Voyager, CZ 5618. You are the leader of your unit. Yes, I am. We wish to negotiate. Negotiate? You and your team will be allowed to leave this vessel with the Oxygen Team to retreat. Sounds good. What do you want from us? We have assimilated information from this unit detailing your previous encounters with CZ 8472. Species 8472? This vessel was engaged in combat with Species 8472 when it infiltrated our vessel. The force probe attacked us during this conflict. Upon destruction of the probe, we were transported to the force. As were several of Species 8472. I don't like where this is headed. Despite our adaptations, Species 7 are you the has released all right so this part is this next little part is going to go by quickly cuz uh ooh health was there a no, there wasn't. Okay. Out of my way, Jarrot. Alright. So, we don't have much ammo there, but we won't need it. How are we gonna take him out with these weapons? Species 8472 can regenerate pretty fast. Since our last encounter with Species 8472, I have modified our weapon designs to be effective against them. Alright. So... What she means by effective against them is they're complete pushovers. They don't even pose a threat. Do remember, I am playing this on the hardest difficulty there is in this game. And they're still unable to take me on with any efficiency whatsoever. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> you guys can't reach me. Is this a cheap tactic? Yes. Do I care? No. These guys hurt. And anyway. More health. 
More ammo. Uh, surprisingly, no dilithium. But yeah, she somehow managed to have time to uh, make all of the weapons we've picked up throughout this game so far. Also, shoot the nanoprobe rounds so that they can easily shred through species 8472. Great, I don't have enough ammo. Even the phasers affect against them. Use some dilithium. How many was that that I just take out with one full charge? Could I use a different weapon? Yes. Am I? No. Because the one that I prefer to use against Species 8472 is currently depleted. Not great. Might as well go over to this. Because if that's there. And before I can get to the Dilithium... Okay, got the dilithium. Got 75 rounds. Want to restock that ammo. Quick save. Ooh, this is good, this is good, this is good. Got more ammo. More ammo. All right, guys. All right, my AI are stupid. Choke point. Down to ten rounds. Down to no rounds. Oh yeah. Alright, don't want to go that way just yet. I want this. Thank you. Any other goodies around? Nope. Seven. Seven. Thank you. Odell, or whoever you are, out of my way. I want to save as much of this as I can. Which is why I'm trying to use every other weapon. Alright, so in this next area, we are no longer going to be attacked by Species A472.
Why are you guys not using uh, iMods? Stay back. Oh yeah. We just caused the board ship to go boom. No. Alright guys, that's it for this episode. See you in the next one.